Hey, seems to me that the uh, criteria for considering something a protest has gotten pretty loose recently. Apparently now, you can still participate in a, a ritual, but if you don't do it in exactly the way that other people think you should, now it's, it's a protest? Yeah, I don't think so. You know, I really like, I really like my flag, but I have never felt the need to pray to my Time's Up flag or to perform any kind of ritual around it. That's just, that's the furthest thing from my mind. It has never entered my mind once. Well, until now. But I'm not going to do it because that's just a really, really strange thing to do. I just, <clears throat> I don't really even get it. The people who are the most vocal about this <clears throat> are also the people who go on and on and on about the things that that holy pole quilt of theirs is supposed to stand for like, you know, freedom and liberty and all that. And yet they spit on that with every word that they utter against those who don't join their strange religious ritual and do it the way they want. It's just, I don't know, they're, they're sick in the head. You know, I care more about whether you arcate against other people than I do how you worship a pole quilt, whether it's my Time's Up flag or any other, you know, some government rag. I don't care. What I care about is how you act towards other people not the worship you give a pole quilt. Anyway, thanks. See you later.